Today we're taking a look at the Connecticut Sun vs. Washington Mystics match, which is happening on Tuesday, June 29, 2021, and giving you my betting tips and predictions in general on this game. Welcome back to High Stakes, let's get straight into it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to get notified as soon as we release these sport prediction videos. And if you would like more betting tips and predictions then check out our Patreon in the link down below. Our new Patreon is a way for us to help you improve your chances of making more money. Five plans are available for each and every one of you. You can get 30 extra betting picks all the way up to 270 extra betting picks per month. Stop wasting hours and hours of your time searching the internet for some fake betting predictions and losing your money because of it. Join High Stakes Patreon now and get the best betting picks and advices instantly. The Connecticut Sun took the court against the Chicago Sky and earned the victory with a final of 74-58 in their last contest. Connecticut walked away from the contest having earned a 42.2% field goal percentage, 27 out of 64, and buried 6 out of their 14 three-pointers. From the free throw line, the Sun knocked down 14 of their 19 attempts, for a rate of 73.7%. Regarding rebounding they earned 38 with 13 of them being of the offensive sort. They also recorded 13 assists for the game as well as forcing 18 turnovers and getting 9 steals. In the matter of defense Connecticut allowed their opponent to shoot 33.3% from the field on 23 out of 69 shooting. Chicago earned 14 assists and had 5 steals for this contest. Additionally, Chicago snagged 34 rebounds, 14 offensive, 20 defensive, and got 6 blocks. Chicago finished the contest at 100.0% from the free throw line by converting 7 of 7 attempts. They also buried 5 of their 24 attempts from distance. The Sun are heading to the game here after getting a win in their last game. The win came over the Chicago Sky by a 74-58 score in the game. With the win the Sun ended up getting a record of 10-5 on the year so far. Jonquil Jones has ended up getting a total of 21.6 points per game while shooting at a clip of 56.8% on the year. The passing has been led by Jasmine Thomas who has ended up getting 4.2 assists per game. Jonquil Jones even leads the rebounding by getting a total of 10.4 boards per game. Brian January is one player who came through for the matchup. She was able to score two points on zero of six shooting. She was on the court for 33-48 minutes and also grabbed one rebound. January walked away from this one shooting 0.0% from the floor and totaled three dimes. Someone else that was a major contributor in the matchup for the Sun was Brianna Jones. She grabbed nine rebounds in her 33-03 min played on the night. She finished 61.5% from the field for the game by going 8 of 13, 21 points. When the time ran out, Jones earned one assist. Connecticut heads into this one with a win-loss record of 10 to 5 on the season. They average 79.3 points per game, 10th in the league, while connecting on 43.6% from the floor. The Sun are connecting on 36.1% on shots from downtown, 108 of 299, and 79.2% from the charity strike. As a team, Connecticut is collecting 36.5 rebounds per contest and has earned 268 assists for the season, which is ninth in basketball in terms of passing. They turn it over 13.9 times per game and as a team they are committing 18.9 personal fouls per contest. When they are on the defensive end, the Sun are forcing their opponents into 12.3 turnovers per game while drawing 18.1 personal fouls. They are third in the league in allowing assists to the opposition with 273 surrendered for the year. The Sun defense is giving up a FG percentage of 41.2%. 185 of 272, and they concede 30.0 boards per game as a team. 
they are surrendering 32.6% on shots from beyond the perimeter and they are first in the WNBA in opponents PPG, 74.3. Washington is heading to the game here after getting handed a loss to the Wings. The loss came by a final score of 85 to 74 on the year. The Mystics are now sitting on a 7 to 8 record on the year after the loss. The Sun have managed to play good on the year so far, but the Sun are also a team that has had some struggles on the year. The Mystics for their part are coming here after losing in their last game, but also having some struggles offensively which will not change in the game here against the Sun. Tina Charles has ended up getting a total of 25.4 points per game while shooting at a clip of 46.3% on the year. Natasha Cloud has managed to get a total of 5.7 assists per game. Charles has ended up getting a total of 9.6 boards per game on the year. The last time they took the court, the Washington Mystics took a loss by a score of 85 to 74 when they faced the Dallas Wings. The Mystics pulled down 27 defensive rebounds and 5 offensive boards for a total of 32 in the game. They gave up possession 10 times, while earning 7 steals in this game. The Wings had 11 personal fouls in this game which took the Mystics to the free throw line for a total of 7 attempts. They were able to knock down 5 of the free throw attempts for a percentage of 71.4%. Pertaining to shooting from distance, Washington made 9 out of their 31 attempts, 29.0%. At the conclusion of this game, the Mystics went 30 for 72 from the field which gave them a percentage of 41.7%. The Mystics permitted the Wings to make 33 out of their 78 attempts from the field which gave them a rate of 42.3% for this contest. They finished the game shooting 34.5% from beyond the arc by going 10 out of 29 and finished the game at 9 out of 9 at the free throw line, 100.0%. When discussing cleaning the glass, Washington permitted Dallas to grab 40 in all, 10 offensive. My first betting advice is to pick Connecticut Sun minus 4. Tina Charles was important for the Mystics for the game. She knocked down 11 out of 23 in the matchup for a field goal rate of 47.8% and accounted for 10 rebounds. Charles racked up 27 points in her 36-24 minutes on the court and accumulated two dimes for this game. An additional player that was important for Washington was Leilani Mitchell. She ended up walking away with seven dimes in her 35-02 mins on the hardwood and she put in five of 11 from the floor. Mitchell ended up shooting 45.5% from the field while also contributing 14 points and 2 rebounds. The Connecticut Sun come into this game with a 10-5 record overall which puts them in first place in the Eastern Conference. Coming into this game, the Sun have won two games in a row in the last game against the Chicago Sky. The defense was strong giving up only 58 points and that led to the blowout victory. On the season, Connecticut is averaging 79.3 points per game while their defense is giving up 74.3 points per game. Jonquil Jones is back for the Sun and he is averaging 21.6 points while shooting 56.8% from the field. Under his 15-6 in the last 21 meetings in Washington. Sun are 5-2 ATS in their last 7 games as a road favorite. Sun are 941 ATS in their last 14 road games. On the other side of this matchup is the Washington Mystics who sit with a 7-8 record overall which puts them in 4th place in the Eastern Conference. The Washington Mystics are struggling coming into this game having lost 2 games in a row. In the last game against the Dallas Wings the offense only managed 74 points and that led to the 11 point defeat. The Washington Mystics on the season are averaging 82.4 points per game while their defense is giving up 83.5 points per game. Tina Charles has been the best player for Washington averaging 25.4 points per game while shooting 48,3% from the field and 36.5% from behind the three-point line. Washington has a win-loss mark of 7-8 for the year. 
the Mystics are responsible for committing 18.7 fouls per contest and they go 84.2% from the charity strike. They are assisting teammates 19.1 times per game, 6th in the WNBA, and they lose possession by turning the ball over 12.2 times per contest. Washington has accounted for 1,236 pints so far this year, 82.4 per game, and they average 35.4 boards per game. On the offensive side of the court, the Mystics are hitting on 40.6% from the floor, which is ranked 12th in the league. The Mystics on defense are ranked 9th in the WNBA in points given up per game with 83.5. They are forcing their opponents into 13.3 turnovers per game and have let teams shoot 44.7% from the field, 10th in the league. The Washington defense allows 40.0% on three-point shots, 126 of 315, and their opponents are connecting on 80.6% of their free-throw shots. They have surrendered 19.5 dimes and 35.4 total boards per game which is 7th and 6th in basketball. My second betting advice is to pick under. Good luck to all of you.